Hello everyone, so I'm just creating a video. Um, what I've been trying to do is I have some LEDs that I'm gonna be doing on some stairs when I redo my stairs. Putting the LEDs on, uh, I'm also using a PER sensor and I had trouble finding a video or information on where you can adjust the time for a PER. A lot of people were saying to adjust it on the PER sensor. That didn't really make a whole lot of sense to me. So here's how you do it if you're having trouble trying to figure this out. So you had you have to create two presets. You create your on state preset and your off state preset. Now I had to figure this out, but it's pretty easy. Pretty much do a preset and you call it whatever you want. Gradient, I just called it on, right? Use current state. This is whatever state you set over here. So I set my colors and my effects, and then I clicked save. And I save that to ID one, right? So it's got a one right here. And then you create an off state where everything's just off. And then you save that state. It, it was really that simple. And then you have to create a playlist. And this is where the magic happens. You create a playlist here where you drop down. And this is where it, I kind of got confused because I was messing with the names. This is giving me on for my preset name that I have. So it's going to run on. And then you have your duration right here. You can set that for whatever you want. I put it just for five seconds for now for this for this video, but I've changed it to 60 seconds. I did 120 seconds for two minutes and it worked every time. Uh, you don't want it to shuffle. You don't want it to repeat indefinitely. It's just going to repeat one time and then it gives you your end preset. Now, if you put repeat indefinitely, it takes that away. So as soon as you click that off, it gives you your end preset, which my end preset is off. All right. So this is a playlist going to trigger on for five seconds and then turn off. And then you're going to, you're just going to save that. So on is one, off is two, and then your playlist, which I called per is number three. Now I'm, I'm doing this on an ESP 32. So then you're going to go to your configuration, go to LED preferences. And this is where you're going to have it set up right here under the, the button. And I just put it on button zero, right? I put it on GPIO 13 is what I have selected. And I have my per sensor on that. I just selected per sensor from the drop down. Then you're gonna save that. And that's whatever GPIO you put it on. I put mine on 13. You can put it on whatever you want and then just put it on the drop down. Time and macros is where you set it to actually run. You're gonna go down to the button actions. Now button zero is what we put that GPIO 13 on. This is where it's gonna trigger. And I put it on the long trigger right here, um, off to on, and that's when it's gonna run three. So the playlist th was ID three, right? Uh, oh shoot, I forgot I'm touch screen. So on was one, off was two, and then the playlist that runs both of those is three. So it's gonna trigger the playlist number three to turn on for five seconds and then turn off. So you save that, go back. Just make sure the LEDs are off, all right? And then we're gonna come down. Sorry, my LEDs are down, downstairs down there. So now I have my sensor, which is the little white box right there. So walk by, triggers them on, five seconds, and they turn off. Walk by, they turn on for five seconds, and they turn off. Excuse the mess. I've just been testing before I cut all these into strips and redo all of my sticks. So I hope this helps someone. If you're struggling with where you can adjust the time, it's all in the playlist that you create right here. And that playlist right here is where you will actually set that time. And we're just gonna save that. So 60 seconds. So let me know if you have any questions. Uh, like I said, I was having trouble trying to figure out where that is triggered on how you can adjust the time that it stays on for. 
Uh, if you have any questions, let me know. But this is what I kind of figured out yesterday.